Well, Christmas returns and discounted prices making for another busy shopping day across the country. I would not want to be out there. Baldwin County reporter Michael Warwick tracking those shoppers along the eastern shore for us. Michael, how's it looking out there today? Lee Shelby, good to be with you too. It's been a much busier day than what I expected coming in. I was out here on Monday, Christmas Eve, and it wasn't too bad, and it's much busier today, the day after Christmas, as it was the days leading up to Christmas. And I've spoken to a few employees at the shops here. We're at the uh, Eastern Shore Center in Spanish Fort. Talked to a Dillard's employee, talked to a couple other employees at the shops here. They said it's busier today than the three days leading up to Christmas. Gives you an idea out here. And in terms of returns, there haven't been too many shoppers telling me they're coming here to return things, which is a good thing, I think. It means they got what they wanted. Uh, or, you know, some of the employees said, well, we're kind of planning on all those returns to come in over the next few days rather than the immediate day after Christmas. We've got some pointers on that coming up. Let's hear what some shoppers around here came out for. It's not the returns, but the deals. Take a listen. We've really uh, had a pretty easy time with traffic, which surprised me. And uh, we enjoy being together as a family and shopping together as a family. Getting more presents, actually. <laughs> yeah, a lot of deals on presents. So we come the day after uh, Christmas to get all the 60% off deals. You walk around here, look at the front doors, the windows, you'll see those big stickers. Clearance, some 50% off after Christmas sales, discounted prices, special deals. It's all out here. That's why the folks are out here at least tonight. And a lot of these shops, the big retailers around here, not going to close until 9 p.m. So you can still get a chance to get out here, even if you want to return something. The lines for that, not too long. We're going to be here this evening, live here in Spanish Fort. I'm Michael Warwick, Fox 10 News. All right, thanks, Michael. And here are some more tips for getting some value out of an unwanted present. Go early in the morning or late at night to return those gifts. That way you can avoid the big crowds. Wait until January to make returns or exchanges. Hang on to the gift receipts to make the process easier, but some stores will still offer credit even if you don't have one. You may also consider selling the gift online at sites like eBay or Amazon, or you can also donate it to a cause you care about.